before we get into this video, please subscribe to my channel, click the bell notification button and please like this video as well. Hello buddy, welcome back to my YouTube channel. As you guys have seen by the title today, I'm doing a QA and and an assumptions video in one. I'm really pushing the boat out, I'm, I'm, I'm basically merging the two video ideas into one today for you guys. Um, because honestly, I absolutely do love filming Q&A and assumptions videos for you guys. I will be trying to leave this video as unedited as I can. Does that make sense? As unedited as I can leave it. But yeah, well, um, basically, like, if I stutter and I find it uncomfortable to leave it in, um, like, I will edit it out. But hopefully, I'll be okay. I am, I am nice and calm today, so hopefully, I'll be all chill in this video. We'll all be vibing together. Do you know what I mean? But anyway, um, so I have got her list on my phone. So I'll just like load all the questions up and kind of read them out and answer your questions and assumptions. Um, so yeah, so without further ado, let's go on the video. So the first one is an assumption and it is your personality is different on camera. Um, my personality is different on camera. I would say that I probably come across as more confident on camera just because it's like you need to be like a bit more confident on camera and you need to kind of speak up on camera as well so I wouldn't say that I'm like really different but um like confidence wise like I'm probably more confident on camera because like if I was quiet on camera like um I would come across as boring and not um interesting so I would say that I probably am slightly more bubbly, <laughs> bubbly, um, bubbly on camera, but I do really like entertaining you guys, you know what I mean? So yeah, right, load up the questions again. Oh, uh, how did I know this question would come up, literally? Are you currently seeing anybody? The answer to that is yes. Um, I do actually like have a video going up with him um, on a day. I'm filming this um, McDonald's mukbang. Um, so please go and watch the video because it's very good. But yes, I am currently seeing somebody right now. Um, um, <laughs> uh, <laughs> oh my god, I'm actually going. Um, but honestly, right. So I'll give you the, like a few details about him. So he's called Scott. He's 19. He lives kind of close to me. Um, he's honestly right. I have never met someone who literally has the exact same personality as me, honestly. He's so sweet, he's so kind, he's so thoughtful and he literally buys me flowers all the time, guys. Like, I have two um, vases of flowers, he literally buys me flowers, like he buys me sweets and chocolate all the time and made me like a little 3k card, which I think is so cute, like honestly, he's so adorable and um, like your support, I am so proud of you and I appreciate you so much. Like my past relationships, the people like who I've been with haven't been very motivated like with the jobs in the future and everything. I wanted to doss about all the time. However, with Scott, he is complete opposite. He is a little angel. Honestly, I've known him almost six weeks and I feel like I've known him for like two years. Honestly, he makes me so happy and I'm so happy that I have met him because he has brought <laughs> so much happiness into my life and you guys I was not even like looking for anybody really um, because like before the lockdown I broke up with my ex and I kind of just wanted to focus like on myself on YouTube and I still am obviously I've been loving uploading on YouTube you know like uploading every day I Honestly, it's so great. I love it so much. Um, but people do say that um, good things come when you least expect it. And it has definitely happened. And I'm so grateful to have him in my life. Literally, I'm just so happy. Honestly, so happy. Would you ever think about um, doing YouTube as a full-time job? Yes, because I do YouTube part-time at the minute. I enjoy making videos and entertaining people so um, doing it full time would be 
amazing. Like, can you imagine being like a YouTuber full time? That would be so good. Like, it literally would be amazing. Like, if I got that opportunity, I'd love to do YouTube full time. Like, it'd be so fun, literally. Oh my god, this one is so funny. Um, you earn more than 2k a month from YouTube. If I was earning more than 2k a month from YouTube, like, like I would not have to work at my uh, my job where I work at now. I wish. From YouTube, I probably earn, uh, like, monthly can vary. Usually £60 to around £150, I would say, probably. It is still something, obviously, but not a lot. But yeah. If I was earning more than 2k a month off YouTube, I would be living my best life because that would be great. <laughs> like, it would be amazing to earn like 2k a month right now. What is your biggest regret? Oh my god, what's my biggest regret? Oh my god, this is actually really hard. What is my biggest regret? I'll probably have to say, um, oh my god, this is actually really hard because. I feel like I don't really, uh, I feel like I do not um, really regret anything really in life. Um, oh my gosh, actually really have probably not been as confident as I would like to. I wish that I could have spoken up more in school and been more confident I think. Because like in school I was really quiet but since leaving school I am a completely different person now, like, I am a lot more confident, I do talk a lot more and overall, I do feel a lot happier since leaving school, like, yeah. Life is great, like, I love my life right now to be honest, like, I'm in such a happy place and honestly it is great, like, I love it, I literally love life right now, it's so good. <laughs> Right, so moving on to the next one. Where could you see yourself in five years? Oh, so like in five years, I will be 23, um, like almost 24 in August. Oh, so 23 years old. Like I would love to have my dream job, so like so basically um, maybe like owning a makeup salon or working in like a makeup salon, maybe doing YouTube full time maybe. Um, if I was fortunate and lucky enough to do it. I would hope to hopefully think about maybe moving in with like my partner or boyfriend into a house. Maybe by the time I'm like I'm 24 maybe like thinking or planning having a kid maybe because I would love to have kids around the age of 24, 25, 26 kind of time. Oh my god in like five and a half years I could maybe have a kid. Wow. I would love to have like a, a stable job and um, maybe like my dream job of like owning a salon, maybe doing YouTube full time and um, hopefully moving with my partner or boyfriend and um, maybe planning on having a child maybe like if you were lucky enough to have children um, so yeah, fingers crossed Do you struggle with your stutter? Um, like some days I do struggle with it every day but I definitely like do have my good days I'm a bad days, um, which is normal, like everyone has the good and the bad days, like it's totally normal. But you mean lockdown, lockdown has definitely made me um, think about it um, more I think, but I definitely do like struggle with it obviously, and it is like on my mind a lot. Um, so yeah. How many kids would you want in the future? Um, two or three, like I would really love a little girl, I'm calling her. Sadie. Like I could just like have like my little mini me. Oh that'd be so cute. <laughs> um I guess two or three kids. It's like I don't really mind what they are but I would really love a little girl deep down though as most of my family are girls so yeah. If you could only eat one food for the rest of your life what would it be? If I could only eat one food for the rest of my life it would be chocolate because I eat chocolate all the time. I am addicted to chocolate like galaxy chocolate dairy milk like kinder oh my god kinder chocolate oh my god take a moment to appreciate kinder chocolate it's unreal i would literally eat chocolate for the rest of my life because i literally love it so much like i could literally live off it honestly i am addicted 
Um, so do you ever compare yourself to other YouTubers? Um, not um, really, no. Like the only time I would ever compare myself to YouTubers is if like like I was having like a bad day. Um, like I only really compare myself to other people when I'm like having like a down day, feeling a bit um, like crap about myself. Please never ever compare yourself to anyone because it's like it's the worst thing that you can do to yourself and it, like it can really put you down so never compare yourself to anyone because everyone is beautiful in their own way so yeah you were closer with your youtube friends than your real friends um probably not like i would say that i'm closer with my friends in real life because i get to see them more often obviously and um i do live pretty close to like all my friends and everything so I am definitely closer to my real life friends but I still love my um, YouTube friends um, you know as well so yeah do you want to move out um, maybe like in a few years not um, now because I cannot afford to move out like I um, don't earn a lot but like hopefully maybe like in a few years like when I'm in my 20s or something like I would love to move like into a house you know, high standards obviously, like marble kitchen, lovely carpets, lovely tiles, you know what I mean, um, with like a three bedroom house. Yes, it's like I'm not asking for a much really guys, you know what I mean. <laughs> Final assumption now guys, like oh my god my hair is literally like all over the place. My bodysuit is actually from Sheen, um, it, like it's gorgeous, it was only like £7 and it was a bargain and I really like it and yeah, it is really nice. Right, so what's the next one? You have a lot of beef with other YouTubers. No. Like, I hate, like, arguments falling out of people. Any beef and drama on YouTube is just awful. Um, so no. I always try to avoid drama because I literally hate drama so much. And it's so annoying and just awful overall, isn't it really, guys? So... Yeah, but anyway guys, here was my um, Q&A and assumptions video. I really hope that um, you guys have enjoyed and got to know a little bit more about me maybe. If you did, make sure to leave a thumbs up, a comment down below and please also subscribe to my channel because I would love to get to 3,100 subs by um, July or in the middle of July hopefully and I would love to hit 4,000 subscribers by my birthday which is the 31st of October um, so it is Halloween Ooh. but yeah anyway I will see you all in my next video bye everybody